Hi, and welcome back to the channel. This is Rob Thomas, your Everything Microsoft Enterprise Cloud Chief Architect. And today we're going to summarize meeting notes using um, inside of a Teams meeting and, you know, leverage the recaps using um, Copilot AI within Teams. All right. So this is a really great topic. I really love. I know we've, we've, we've kind of understand this, but um haven't really you know most of us haven't really gone through it and we're just kind of learning live like we're in meetings so i definitely want to cover this so without further ado let's jump into this but without um further ado let's give a shout out to our sponsor and that's going to be the software enterprise software solution the software dudes these guys are great for any of your microsoft sql server microsoft windows server microsoft azure microsoft copilot ai microsoft 365 microsoft dynamics 365 needs i highly recommend you reach out to them these are their existing customers i'm a customer partner these guys are great you know in times past when you have these hard microsoft dynamic questions these guys are great they can answer them they can help you make you super successful any of your ai copilot or azure you know same thing some challenges here you definitely can reach out to these guys these guys are awesome all right so let's jump into this so without further ado let's jump into our and i want to move this over here our actual microsoft teams right so how many times have you left a meeting and immediately thought wait what were the action items again? Or maybe you joined a meeting 10 minutes late and spent the whole time trying to figure out what the heck did I miss? This has happened to all of us, right? So what if you had an AI assistant that could automatically take your notes for you, summarize a meeting and even answer your questions about that meeting without disrupting that meeting, right? Today, I'm gonna to show you how AI powered meeting summaries from, this is important, Teams Premium and Microsoft Copilot are complete game changers for your productivity, right? So let's jump into this. So before the magic can happen, there's one crucial step I need to mention. For the AI to work, your meeting must be recorded and transcribed. So in a live meeting, you need to click the more button and go to the record and transcripts and make sure you start both. So your assistants will need at least five minutes of the meeting to have enough material to work with. Now, uh, my, I'm recording today and this could be a little funky so i recorded one right here so we'll do that but i want to just show you where that is so let's kick off that meeting let's start it and hope this doesn't you know break on me um meeting about um workflow i'll just call it meeting about workflow change the name don't break and let's just get this to go all right cool I'm going to quickly show you this and I'm going to cancel this really quickly. You'll go here, you go to transcribe, and then you go to start, and then you do that, and then boom, it started. All right. So we got that going. I'm going to stop this because I don't want this to mess up what I'm doing. So I'm going to leave the meeting, and then I'm going to say the quality was good. All right. Now I'm going to go back to my calendar. So, all right. So I did that meeting really quickly just kind of just show you how to kick kick that off now a huge benefit of for those of you with a co-pilot license is the ability to ask for a summary of the the meeting while the meeting is still happening so you'll see a co-pilot button um, and you can click on that and type something like what did i miss if i joined late or if and it will give you a recap of the discussion for it, which is a lifesaver Let's go back and do that again. <laughs> let's do a meeting now. And then I'm gonna meeting now with Rob Thomas like four. Let's start a meeting. And I wanna show you where that copilot button is. I'm gonna do it again. And hope that my other recording that's recording on top of this doesn't break. All right, let's say I'm gonna go back in and I'm gonna do the same thing. And then hit start, confirm, right? And then what I was talking about is this, like I could click copilot right there and then copilot isn't available and then but again right it needs five minutes we're only like 30 seconds so i could i could i could type in here um as i was mentioning earlier before is like what did i miss right and then it will copilot will go through and capture you know i need to hear more discussions before i see here so imagine i was going on for 30 minutes it'll just give you some information right and it, it'll let you know what's going on which is really, really powerful capability here without disrupting the meeting. All right. Now, for, let's, let's take a look at our AI notes. You know, the AI has automatically, can automatically generate a summary of the major discussion point. You know, no frantic, you know, um, uh, scrambling, right, to, during the meeting to try to, like, figure that out. 
And also, that's not all. Like you can also click the topics button and it will create a timeline of the different subjects that were discussed and you can click on topics and the recording and it will jump to that right point. So I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna show you a, a older previous meeting. So let's leave this meeting. All right, again, I, I left the first one a little too early. We're gonna click on this one, right? Now it's, you can see here, you could do it in calendar and I, I was able to click on it. You could do it in calendar um, and then the calendar will like just spin this, uh, this will like spin it up as another link. But it's a little bit more easy if you do it inside of Teams. So again, I'm in Teams and Calendar. So I can click on an old me uh, meeting I did just like 30 minutes ago. I could click here. And then what I want to do is I want to view recap. So if I click recap here and then boom, as I was just talking about like the AI notes. So boom, like here's our AI notes. And this meeting was only like five minutes. So it's not going to give me a lot, of, a lot of information. But I could click notes, AI notes, mentions. So anytime I was mentioned, I'll talk about this in a little bit, um, transcript. And it'll show the transcripts of everything I was saying. And then as I was talking about topics, I could click on topics and then it'll jump. Again, it's not long, so I can't get here. It will show chapters again, just one chapter, three seconds, right? And then speakers, are there more than one speaker? And I just click on the, you know, uh, mentions, uh, mentions of me every time I'm mentioned and I could just see the speaker and, and so forth, right? So that just gives you a little bit of um, deep dive into the actual going into meetings where these meetings are stored and then getting this information. All right, so here's a quick question that a lot of people have. Like, what's the difference between these AI features in Teams Premium and Copilot? Well, most of the features we just saw are AI notes, topics, speaker timelines. They're all available in both add-ons. But if you have Microsoft 365 Copilot license, you get a superpower. You can even further um, ask the AI direct specific questions about the meeting, which is super awesome. So and I'll give you kind of an idea. Let's say a coworker mentioned a problem with a new system. I can type a question like, what are the challenges our Boomi integrations um, are facing with our new SAP ERP system, right? Um, Copilot will search the entire transcript of the meeting and give you a precise answer. This is an incredible tool for finding specific information without having to rewatch the entire meeting. So that is super, super powerful, right? So wanted to mention that, um, and then you can just like, go back to, to AI notes. Um, so AI meeting summaries are a true game changer. They free you up from taking notes and give you powerful tools to quickly find the information you need, whether it's the main points, a specific topic, or with Copilot, the answer to a direct question. Now, I would love to hear from you. What is one thing you would love to ask an AI about your next meeting? Let me know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, give it a like and make sure you don't miss out on our next videos. Be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell on your way out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day and I'll see you in the next one.